The baby's reaction after being arrested will shock you. <laughs> the baby is here. He's, the baby's here. And he's flossing, literally. AKA, thank it ain't on me. How y'all feeling this morning? <laughs> <laughs> What's up, my brother? Grammy nominated rapper The Baby has finally been released from Miami Dade Jail after getting arrested multiple times just weeks ago. As if him getting arrested wasn't surprising enough, his reaction to the whole scenario will surprise you even more. He has since commented on his arrest and seems pretty upset that he had to go through that entire fiasco. Many rappers and U.S. citizens complain about the legal system and believe that it's unjust. DaBaby felt targeted by police as he's been arrested three times within a month and his legal troubles seem to occur more and more frequently as his celebrity status grows. DaBaby's music is extremely catchy and he seems to have everyone singing along to his songs. He's very focused on his music and career, so it was a huge shock to fans when the news broke that he had been arrested. Thankfully, he's hired one of the strongest legal teams that money can buy, and they were able to get him out within a matter of days. He will be going to trial soon, where a judge will determine if he has to serve additional time in jail for these various charges. Today at Lime Report, we will be discussing DaBaby's release and his reaction in dealing with his recent legal battles. Be sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and comment the keywords Billion Dollar Baby below to get a chance at winning in our $100 Amazon gift card giveaway. Now let's continue. The Baby's Promising Career The Baby can't seem to catch a break lately, as he was arrested in two different states just last month, which again was a shock to many fans. The North Carolina rapper has taken over the rap game throughout 2019 and has become a very well respected artist in the music industry. He didn't seem to get in much trouble before these incidents, as he spends most of his time in the studio working on his craft. He was arrested on some pretty serious charges that ranged from robbery to battery, and believes this was just a part of him being targeted. Since getting released from jail, he has taken to Instagram to express how he felt about his arrest and legal situation. He wrote, To whom it may concern, please stop talking to me about that weak 48 hours I spent in jail and that failed attempt to break my spirits and interrupt the path I'm taking to my God-given success. He continued, I remain composed and focused on knowing allegations made of without honesty and integrity will never be honored by the Most High. Please be reminded that sucka situations like these aren't worthy of your time or attention. DaBaby has earned his respect and he's proven his hood reputation time and time again from fighting off robbers to rapping about his life and speaking on his tough actions. He basically said 48 hours spent in jail was nothing to him and that it felt like he was targeted during his rise to success. He wants people to know that stories are being made up against him and that the story on what really happened has been exaggerated. At the end of the day, DaBaby was just punking someone who owed him money, as any OG rapper would do. He feels this was a waste of time for him and he doesn't want anyone else wasting his time talking on the situation or giving it attention. He also wrote, Don't allow yourself to be misled by janky promoters and lazy grown men itching for the opportunity to file a lawsuit that they won't win. This hints that he believes the club promoter and his associates were trying to set him up as some people are lazy and try to get money by suing others. It has been done before and DaBaby feels as if now people are trying to set him up now. Regardless, DaBaby has a huge following and has been nominated for a Grammy. At this point, his career is extremely promising. He won't be going anywhere anytime soon as long as he can keep himself out of trouble after these incidents. His debut studio album, Baby on Baby, has gone two times platinum after being released in 2019. He has proven himself as a rap artist and has taken the game by storm. There have been other rappers in the same shoes that have had similar struggles or worse. When you are in the limelight, unfortunately, there will be haters who want to bring you down. Legendary rappers Biggie and Tupac have lost their lives during the peaks of their careers, although the reason behind their deaths remains a mystery. It is obvious it has to do with some type of jealousy or haters. Sadly, this is the type of hate the baby is facing on a smaller scale. Speaking on the incident after being released Anyone would be upset after getting arrested multiple times in a short period of time. DaBaby was vocal about how he felt about his arrest and how he felt targeted. During his Instagram rant, he also wrote, Don't allow yourself to become lost in the sauce or misinformed about the media. Unfortunately, the media seems to portray or exaggerate sometimes to gain more interest or viewers. DaBaby is a real one and is warning fans not to believe everything that is being said about him. All of this attention and legal battles have fueled the baby and he's actually excited to beat these cases and focus back on his music. He takes his music very seriously and has a close connection to his fan base. 
On the last part of his post, he confirmed that he will be releasing new music soon and wrote, I encourage you to all kick back, relax, and prepare yourselves for this new wave of music and entertainment I have prepared for you all. We can't wait to see what he has in store. He puts just as much focus into his music videos and loves to put together an experience his fans will really enjoy. Sources believe that he is working on his third studio project that will be released soon. Legal Case and Past Fights There was video footage released recently that showed DaBaby and his crew jumping two men and taking some of their possessions. The rapper was arrested and facing battery charges in this robbery case. He apparently beat up his club promoter and his associates for an incomplete payout from when he performed at Cafe Iguana in Pembroke Pines. Law enforcement confirmed the 28-year-old rapper, as well as a couple of his crew members, had beat up the club promoter and another employee. The promoter was $10,000 short of paying DaBaby a $30,000 performance fee. After fighting the promoter, whose name was Kenneth, DaBaby and his crew also took Kenneth's cell phone, bank card, and $80 from his wallet. Kenneth also stated that he was doused in apple juice by the crew after being jumped. The promoter obviously wasn't too happy about this and allegedly plans to sue the rapper for his injuries. Despite him acting violently, many fans are defending DaBaby as he was just going after money that he was owed. He had tactics of his own to teach the promoter a lesson for shortening him on the money. And this isn't the first time he has been caught on camera proving his strength. Just as his career was starting to take off in 2019, there was a video that went viral of DaBaby fighting someone in a designer store. Someone was talking smack to the rapper inside of a Gucci store and DaBaby was recording it on his phone. The person who was talking smack had tried to punch DaBaby at one point and DaBaby had punched him, which knocked him to the floor. He beat him up and left him in his underwear to humiliate him. All of this occurred in the retail store. DaBaby recorded the guy on the floor with a bloody nose and said, I'm the truth. Knocked him out. Me? Dolo. This video came out at a great time as his career was just starting to take off and this brought him a lot of respect and proved that he is not someone to mess with. It helped confirm his reputation as a tough rapper and proved he is about his word. DaBaby also had a warrant for his arrest in Texas for another battery charge after getting into a fight at the airport with a food stand employee. There was also a video of this incident that has surfaced and it showed DaBaby and his associates fighting off the airport employee in the food court. He is a great fighter and is willing to fight for his reputation. This is what makes DaBaby DaBaby. He was arrested in Miami after his latest fight with the promoter who was short on his payment and his arrest lasted about two days since his legal team was able to get him out super quick. He will still see a judge at some point where it will be determined if he will have to spend more time in jail or if this case will be dismissed. The promoter who was assaulted did say he planned to take action against DaBaby for his injuries and humiliation. He had shared photos of his bruises and injuries and it appears he will try to maximize this situation. He will likely testify against DaBaby at his next court hearing for this battery charge which could affect the rapper's sentencing. DaBaby has a strong legal team who has proved themselves before, and they will be ready for any legal heat that Kenneth the promoter comes at them with. Do you think Kenneth will win any type of settlement for getting jumped? Or did he have it coming to him for setting the wrong expectations and for failing to pay DaBaby for his performance? There are many different opinions on the situation, but many fans are standing behind the Charlotte rapper and trust his word. DaBaby came to Miami, performed his set at Cafe Iguana, but didn't get the payout he was promised, so he decided to take action. We hope the judge will understand this and that his case will be dismissed. We will keep you updated in the future when his hearing date gets assigned. DaBaby started to see some serious success after dropping his hit track called Suge. He's also dropped a music video for this song, which has since generated hundreds of millions of views. This song went viral all over social media, and this put DaBaby on the rap radar very quickly. Shortly after this, he dropped his debut album titled Baby on Baby, which has gone two times platinum since its release. He has also more recently dropped an album called Kirk, which has plenty of fire hits and is on his way to going platinum. DaBaby has a promising career, and with all of the traction and attention he's been getting, he will be dropping his next album very soon. He's only been in the rap game for a couple of years now, and it seems that he is here to stay. Who are you looking forward to hearing him work with next? He's already collaborated with music icons like Justin Bieber, and J. Cole has even included him with his Dreamville Revenge for the Dreamers 3 album. There are many other artists that respect the baby and are excited to work with him. Thanks for tuning in to Lime Report today while we discuss DaBaby and his reaction to his arrest and legal situation. We will keep you updated as new details come out on his upcoming court hearing. 
Don't forget to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and comment the keywords Billion Dollar Baby below to get a chance at winning in our $100 Amazon gift card giveaway. We'll see you on the next one.